If you want to add product wishlist and product compare features to your WooCommerce store, then this video is for you. Royal Elementor add-ons expert plan comes with new features that lets you add wishlist and compare buttons to your products. Your customers will be able to add products in the wishlist and visit them later, or compare multiple products to easily decide which one is better for them. Wishlist and product compare can be displayed as a sidebar or pop-up and you can create a separate pages for them as well. To begin with, first you're gonna need Royal Elementor add-ons expert plan, and right now I'm on my shop's archive page, so let me edit it with Elementor Editor. Let's make sure that we are editing WooCommerce Grid. Next in Content, go to Elements, and click on Add Item. In Select Element, choose Wishlist button, and you can see that the button is already displayed. Now I'm gonna very quickly adjust a few settings to make sure that everything looks pretty. Let's set the location to over media and change the position to top right. And in wishlist action, choose notification pop-up. Click on add item again. This time I want to add compare button, so in select element, choose compare button. Let's quickly change the location and position again. And for compare action, choose notification pop-up. I'll explain this setting in a moment. But for now, let's just update the page and go back to the dashboard. Because next we have to add separate pages for both product compare and product wishlist. Click on add new. Give it a name. You can call it whatever you like. And finally, click on edit with Elementor. On this page, we need to add a new widget called Wishlist Table. So drag and drop it into the section. You can see that there's no products in the wishlist yet. Let's publish the page. Go back to the dashboard, because we have to add one more page for Product Compare. Let's just call it Compare, and edit with Elementor. But this time we have to add another new widget called Compare Table. Publish the page and go back to the dashboard. Now we need to go to Royal Add-on Settings page. Scroll down a bit and in Select Compare page, let's select the page which we've just created for Products Compare and do the same for Wishlist page. I'm gonna select my wishlist and finally click on Save Changes. In Royal Add-ons Theme Builder, Let's customize the header, so click on Edit Template, because I want to add Compare and Wishlist buttons in the header section as well. This time we need the widget called Mini Wishlist. Let's place it here. Let me disable the widget title text, as well as open a new tab, and set the width to inline just to align the buttons nicely. Next I'd like to add the Mini Compare button. So let me drag and drop it here. Again, I'll disable the title text and new tab options. And set the width to inline. Update the header and go back to the dashboard. And finally, let's edit the product single template. So click on edit, because I think it will be better if we add wishlist and compare buttons to single product pages as well. Let me find another new widget called Wishlist button and place it here. Go back to the widgets and this time add Compare button. Right below the wishlist. Update the template and go back to the dashboard. Because now if we visit the Shops page, here they are, our Wishlist and Compare buttons. You can see them in header as well, so let me click on Add to Wishlist. You can see that it shows a little pop-up notification, which we've selected in Settings. If I click here, it shows a little drop-down. We can visit the Wishlist page from here, or go back and add some products to compare. Let me select a few, and it also shows the little pop-up and from the header we can go to Compare page. Let's go back and click on one of the products just to make sure that the buttons are displayed on a single product page as well. 
In the last part of this video, I want to show you some of the settings that comes with wishlist and compare buttons. Right now, if we click on this icon, it shows the drop down, and clicking on compare icon takes us to the compare page. But we can change few settings here, including for this icon. So in Royal Addons Theme Builder, let's edit the header template. Click on Mini Wishlist widget. And in Wishlist Content, instead of drop down, set it to sidebar. Next, edit the Mini Compare widget and set the Compare content to pop up. Let me update the header. Go back to the shop page and refresh it. And now, if I click on Mini Wishlist icon, it shows products as sidebar. From here, you can still go to Wishlist page. And Mini Compare widget shows the products as pop up window, which could be quite convenient. Right now, if I click on this Wishlist button, it shows a little notification, but we can set it to sidebar as well. So let's edit the products archive by clicking here. Let's make sure that we're editing the WooCommerce grid. And in Elements, we need to go to Wishlist button and set the Wishlist action to Open Mini Wishlist Sidebar. Basically, that's it. Let's update the products archive. And now, if we visit the Shops page again, clicking on Wishlist icon will display the sidebar similar to mini wishlist button in header. That's how easily you can add product wishlist and product compare features to your WooCommerce store when using Royal Addons Expert Plan. If you have any questions, go to royalelementoraddons.com where you can get help from our support team. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon.